on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. Um, so what did you want to talk to me about, Mr. All Might? Um, you can just call me uh, All Might or Toshinori or Mr. Yagi. You don't have to. Really? Okay, uh, All Might. Um, so what did you want to talk to me about? Well, first, I need to know if you can keep a secret. Of course. I used to be quirkless. Uh, what? But you just turned out to be late bloomer or something, right? Mm, no. You see, I was given this quirk. It was passed down to me by a very important woman. Oh, uh, what happened? She passed away by the hands of that man that you helped us capture. I'm so sorry to hear that. Either way, <clears throat> she entrusted her court to me, and I would like to do the same for you, as well as train you on how to use it. I would like to give you one for all. Uh, what? I would like to give you my quirk. To help yours grow ever stronger. Uh, um, I, uh, I, I don't, I, yeah. you don't have to answer now. Just, um, here, call me whenever you, uh, you know, whenever. It doesn't even have to be about my offer. Yeah, anyway, farewell, young Midoriya, Midoriya, yeah, Midoriya, as all my jumps away. Izuku, just trying not to freak out, he's just saying, oh my, really just gave, just, just offer me his quirk and to, to make me more powerful? As a whole rush of emotions is starting to pretty much overtake Izuku, on one hand, this is a great opportunity not only to get even stronger, but also get training from the number one hero. Wow, who wouldn't want that? But he barely seems to really scratch the surface of what he can do with his quirk, as he thinks of it. Yeah, he, so far he's been doing such childish things, but the fact that he was able to heal All Might, just send a villain away, bring them back just from knowing their name, what else can he do? And adding a quirk enhancer to that? Something that'll make him even stronger? His quirk even stronger? That'll be madness. But he can help a lot of people as well, so... Should he accept it? He's thinking. Which he actually talks to Bakugo more on it and it's like um I've been given a great opportunity to train with the number one hero what y you all might I oh you did say man it all makes sense what do you think I should do take the deal T take the training you if anything, considering what I saw in the news, you 
you probably just scratch the surface of what you can actually do. I mean, so if he's going to help you get stronger, huh? Yeah, that's that, that's a good thinking. But yeah. If anything, you're still getting strong off your own power, right? Right. Seriously, you should use your power to become a great hero, but getting some help along the way, some training or whatnot, is it going to hurt? Hmm. You're right. Thank you, uh, Kachan. Uh, yeah. No, no, don't, don't call me that. Not yet. I haven't been the best friend. So please don't call me that. Until I'm actually comfortable with you doing it. Okay. Either way, I've made my decision, and uh, thank you for that. Thank you for being a real friend. Sure. I'm sorry how I've acted before when we were younger. I just gotta inflate the ego. I felt pride when it came to my quirk. That's that's understandable. It was amazing. It was a amazing quirk. It still is. But for some reason, even though I knew that, why does it sound better coming from you? What? Uh, nothing. <sighs> nothing, nothing, nothing. Just, let's not worry about it. Um. See you, uh, when I see you, Izuka. Right. Um, okay. No problem. Them going their separate ways. Toshi, are you sure about this? Sir, if he if he takes my quirk, he will be unstoppable. That's what scares me. But you saw what he did. Everyone on the news. Everyone watching it. Witnessing it saw what that boy did. But you adding power onto that is <sighs> terrifying. You don't know what it could do to him or his quirk. He healed you, captured all for one, by just snapping his fingers. What if, what if you give him a roll and it's... It overloads him or something. It, maybe if it, he can even thought about the fact that if he had one bad thought, like he wants all the villains to go away, do you know what that could? I haven't thought of that, but I'm standing by my choice. He is my first choice. If he wants my quirk, I will willingly give it to him. If he doesn't, then I will find someone else. Do you really think he's going to reject your quirk? You're the number one hero. N no one will reject your quirk. No one's that pure. No one's... 
that's selfless to let you give it to someone else. I have faith in the kid. Yeah. Now I have faith in you too. I and look at you now. All right. <clears throat> you trust the the kid enough and to let him in on your little secret to actually offer the quirk to him. Fine. I'm with you. I don't have to like your choices and decisions, but at the very least, I gotta respect it. Thanks, Master. Well, whether that kid uh, accepts or not, I plan on putting him through the ringer. What? Oh, yeah. Seriously, so I really wonder. Huh. What if he can reverse time? W what? Yeah, I mean, he healed you and put it all for one behind bars. What if he can actually reverse time and at least give me my youth back? Could you imagine how much stronger I'd be if I was in my prime? Huh? Yeah, it'll be just like the old days where I used to beat the shit out of you. <gasps> <gasps> what? As all my just jumps away, he's like, fuck this. You are not going anywhere near that kid. He's like, what? What'd I say? Is all my is just jumping away, trying to evade and get away from the Gran Torino. Gran Torino was just like, come on! It was just a suggestion. We don't even know if the kid can reverse time, or ages, or whatnot. I don't want to risk it. Uh, <clears throat> I can still kick her ass right now. Going to catch me as he, as he gets drop kicked by Gran Torino. I got you. Uh, that's not fair. You may have all that power, Toshi, but uh, I got the experience. Uh, uh. Plus, yeah, I know this area a lot better than you do. <laughs> as soon as his phone rings, huh? Who's this? Hmm. Oh, uh, young Midoriya. Uh, hey, 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 uh, all my, can we talk in private? Um, of course, sure. This is about my your offer. Yes, I've made my decision. Oh, all right. Uh, where do where and when do you want to meet up? As Izuku just teleports right to him, grabs hold of his shoulder and teleports him somewhere else. Gran Torino, like what just happened? Did that kid just kidnap? Toshinori? Uh, what? I, I was just... You... How? Yeah, I can teleport now. Uh, but I... Uh, this is... Crazy. Either way, uh, <clears throat> you've made your decision, you said. I I have. Great, uh, what is it? I don't want your quirk. I, I will accept the training for me and my friend. What? Friend? Bakugo Kotsky. He helped me make my decision. You didn't know 
I didn't tell him that you wanted to g give me your quirk or anything. I, like I said, I could keep a secret, but I did tell him about you wanting to train me, if nothing else. Oh. Thank God. You asked if I could keep a secret, and then I gave you my word. <sighs> Thank you. So, you, you don't want my quirk. Well, who wouldn't want it, but... I want to become the number one hero off my power. And so is Kotsky. We both want to become great heroes. But... I don't want to... Use someone else's power. But you would have been able to make this power your own. Yeah, but maybe if under different circumstances or something, like I didn't have a quirk or I didn't have this power. I And you saw something else within me, maybe. I Maybe then I would have accepted it, but I can't. I can't. Right now, my power is enough. Mm, that this is a right now I'm learning new things about it I didn't even think were possible <laughs> so at the very least I uh, what's with that face as he sees all my w big ass smile and shedding a tear is it like, uh, is there something wrong? Do you need a tissue? No, I just... You are too innocent. What? Yes, I... I can't explain it, but you... Are you an angel? It, no, I, I... I don't have wings or anything, at least none that I've noticed or my mom's told me. I, it's just, I don't mean an actual angel, son. It's just, how are you so pure and innocent? Uh, I don't understand the question. <clears throat> Never mind. So when do you and this Bakugo Koski want to begin your training? I'm fine with it, whichever, as long as it doesn't completely, you know, overlap with my hero work. Well, whenever it's good for you, I suppose. Plus, I'm still going to tell him that you accepted. Wait, he doesn't... No, I didn't tell him. I, I wanted to be surprised just in case you did say yes, or I didn't want him to be disappointed if you said no. You are too pure for this world. What the hell? What? N nothing. Nothing. Just... <sighs> Either way, the answer is yes. I will train both of you. <sighs> How about this? Why don't you help me find a successor as well? At the very least, but help me with that. What are you... Well, since you don't want my quirk for yourself, could you at least help me find someone who you deem as worthy of it? At the very least? I... Um... Sure, yeah. Okay, so can you take me back because I'm pretty sure uh, Gran Torino is right now crapping a brick. Oh, oh, right. Oh, I'm sorry you were with your friend. I I am very sorry about that. Him teleporting on my back to the rooftop where Gran Torino's like flipping out. Now let's get to the Hero Association in which... 
Should we try to bribe the boy? He's a child. He doesn't really have much value. Value, knowledge about money or fame or whatnot. From what we can tell, he just wants to be a hero. So, isn't that enough? No. No, it's not. Why? Someone that doesn't have a price can be more dangerous than someone who can be bought.